The substitute teacher accused of molesting two little kids at an Osceola County elementary school is now out of jail. Deputies say the 19-year-old teacher admitted to touching those children. Good evening to you. I'm Eric Von Anke, and Thanks for being with us. I want to get right out to News 6 with Jerry Askin, who is live at Boggy Creek Elementary School. Jerry, you talked to the teacher's neighbors. Eric, yes, and I tell you, I've been working to reach um, Mr. Asher for hours today. And meantime, we are, we're learning he's actually off the job here at Boggy Creek Elementary School. Um, neighbors describing him as a somewhat friendly, um, yet very quiet person. This all happening as he's now out of jail, but facing some pretty serious charges. I wanted to get his side of the story, see what Fanu Saadassin Asher had to say now that he's bonded out from jail in Osceola County. I went by his home today. No one answered. He also never returned my phone calls. But Wanda Valley, who has a four-year-old granddaughter. That's my neighbor. He lives right there. Was full of shock when I told her deputies say Asher inappropriately touched at least two small girls last week. All happening, investigators say as he was teaching at nearby Boggy Creek Elementary School here. As a parent, how does it make you feel? Oh, grandparent. Very wary. Very wary. Because... You know, he's so close, and I have my granddaughter. The kids here call him Mr. Archer. School leaders told us he was working here as a substitute teacher. He told investigators he thought the seven and eight-year-old girls were beautiful and attractive, according to court documents. On one occasion, deputies say it happened as a girl came to his desk asking him a question during her test. I'm in chat because he looked very quiet, mm -hmm. very polite. Well educated. Here's their first degree felonies. 19 year old Usher had his first appearance Saturday morning. Right now we're asking school leaders more about the training and requirements in general for all substitute teachers. That's, that's crazy. It's crazy. Yeah, we're also verifying right now that Asher was actually given a background check. In the meantime, we do know that he's been working as a sub here at the school in Osceola County since December. Meantime, school leaders told us they're working with law enforcement in this investigation. We're live in Osceola County, Kissimmee. I'm Jerry Askin, getting results, New 6. Yeah, I think a lot of parents have a lot of questions about this, Jerry. Thank you. We'll see.